<laughs> well, this is weird. Hey guys, it's Isla and slide to the left. So guess where I am? It's university. We're here. <laughs> if you didn't know already, I'd moved to Darwin University last week and I've so far had the best time ever, but mostly because it's Freshers' Week. So, um, who doesn't have fun in Freshers' Week? I'm right, I'm right. <laughs> so relatable. But because I basically have today, I thought I'd give you a room tour because <laughs> why not? Don't know about you, but I am in love with interior decorating. I don't know, it's just it's just a mini hobby of mine. One thing I should get out of the way before this, um, I forgot to bring my camera with me. Uh, yeah, I'm that idiot. So while it is currently being posted to me, this video is filmed on my phone, so please excuse the horrible audio quality and probably picture quality. Thank you, goodbye. So here we have it. We start off with the door. Lovely fire escape signs, great. And this is my great laundry bag, which has a washing machine on it, which I think is freaking cool. And past the door, we come to the wardrobe. Here, I have some lovely hooks from Tiger, which as you can see, I was supposed to put on the back of the door, but they didn't fit because of this stupid thing right here. Got my towel, my dressing gown, and my coats, because I'm practical. Here is the front face of the wardrobe. Lovely, beautiful clothes, and a beautiful, oh, hello there. Vogue. Got all my clothes in here, my shoes, and then these two drawers I've got bags and trousers. Yes. Then moving in from the wardrobe, we have my bathroom area. As you might be able to tell, I am not in ensuite accommodation, so I've just got a sink in my room. I'm definitely not dying on the inside because I have to wait for others to shower until I can shower. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> So here I've got another mirror with another beautiful specimen behind, hello over there, with a lovely light, oh magic, all my bits and bobs and more bits and bobs down here, Whee! If you don't think this accommodation is luxury, I even got a towel rail. Moving around from there I have a bin, including a recycling bin, yeah. And up from that I've got this lovely pin board which I have decorated beautifully if I may say so myself. This is my lovely whiteboard monthly calendar which you may have seen before in my study tour. Check that video right there. This is my Levis photo. I am right here being an absolute twat. And here is something I made because I'm a loner. <laughs> which has loads of quotes and stuff from musicals which I really like. Yeah, moving from there we have the desk area. Up on the top shelf we've got some wine glasses, well done card, these fairy lights. Moving down we've got a box full of food, including some hot chocolate, which is lush. Get this. My light up sign. This is the current message because I'm a fresher. And this has got loads of important documents in it, like passport and like student loan information because I'm a student now. Way. And finally down here, we've got loads of files I haven't managed to fill yet. A jar of sweets, which no longer has any sweets in it. My timetable and my makeup box. Way. In these drawers, I've got stationery, underwear, and other random crap. Storage. Moving over here, we've got my freshest poster. Yes, if you're wondering, I'm in Collingwood College. The stag is our mascot, hence this whole thing. And then I've got my printer, because I had one lying around the house, don't judge me, okay? And then here, we've got printer, paper, and batteries and things. My dressing up drawer, because I was a unicorn, insert picture now. And down here, I've got all my cutlery and stuff because I'm also in catered accommodation. And no, catered accommodation doesn't mean that I buy food and then someone cooks it for me, as one of my friends thought. This just means it's like a dining hall and we just, instead of getting a kitchen, a small pantry-like thing. So yeah. I don't have to learn to cook until second year, way! Moving on, we have our radiator, which I have this weird thing, which is kind of like a drawing rail. I've got my lovely little cacti, and actually, quite a nice view. Yeah, it's pretty lovely. Oh wait, no. I love waking up at eight in the morning, and I was supposed to have a lion, because tractors are a thing that exists. Anyway, let's stop being bitter and move on to the bed. This is my collage that I've made and don't you dare diss it, I am extremely proud of this. This is my interrailing ticket and you can see here I've got all the places that I went to and I think it's a really cool thing to have. And I've got my lovely blankets here, I've got two because I have friends. <laughs> and my lovely duvet with my cushions and this little table up here just, just has loads of convenient things like a lamp and a radio and stuff like that. Down here I have a box. I would recommend getting a box like this. This is full of clothes that aren't dirty but also not clean. Trust me, it is extremely useful. 
you will want one and it will not clog up the floor. Advice from slide to the left, hey! Anyway, thank you very much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed this room tour and it gives you decor ideas. I don't know, whatever you got from it, that's great. I will see you next week with another video from my room, Love and Life. Who knows, I might tell you what happened in my freshers week and in case you want to join too. Over and out and now cut to cool montage of the room. Bye!